Globally, we are seeing a rise in infections caused by multi-drug resistant gram-negative bacteria. This is especially the case in the intensive care unit in patients with hospital acquired or ventilator associated pneumonia, HAP and VAP. Patients with HAP and VAP spend more time in the intensive care unit and are at a much greater risk of mortality. Unfortunately, these patients are also more likely to experience delays in starting appropriate antibiotic therapy, further increasing their risk of poor outcomes. These include an approximately 20% increase in the risk of in-hospital mortality, a 70% increase in length of hospital stay, and a 65% increase in total in-hospital costs, regardless of the susceptibility status. So, how can we work together to address the growing threat of multi-drug resistant gram-negative infections? Effective management of HAP and VAP relies on early appropriate antibiotic therapy with adequate pathogen coverage. This should be based on local surveillance data and the risk profile of the patient. As a global anti-infectives leader, Pfizer is working with infectious diseases community to find solutions to combat the threat of multi-drug resistant gram-negative infections. As a testament to this, Pfizer has been recognized as the number one company for stewardship and ranks in the top two leading research-based pharmaceutical companies within infectious diseases. Pfizer is proud of its commitment and leadership in addressing antimicrobial resistance through a broad set of industry-leading solutions, including the antimicrobial stewardship programs and ATLAS, one of the largest antibiotic and antifungal surveillance platforms in the world. Earlier this year, Pfizer further evolved ATLAS from an industry-recognized antibacterial surveillance website to a broader antimicrobial surveillance platform with the inclusion of antifungal data via integration of the Sentry surveillance data. We are driven by our desire to protect global public health and address the unmet medical needs of people suffering from infectious diseases. We remain committed to developing innovative medicines and vaccines as well as solutions to go beyond medicine.